I'm sure that many of you have obviously tested your internet speeds, either going to Google and, and searching uh, speed test and either using the Google or some other website. Uh, used to always be flash applications, but luckily uh, we've moved beyond that. Uh, but you're doing that through the web browser. Let's say you wanted to test it from your shell, uh, your command line here. Maybe you have a, a, a script that tests it. Well, the good thing is you can test your speeds from your shell or command line. Uh, and uh, on Debian basis, you do sudo apt install speed test dash uh, CLI is uh, what it is, at least on Debian. It might be something else. Just search your package manager for speed test and see if it comes up. I already have it installed, but you would hit enter on that and obviously type in your password and install that package. Once it's installed, uh, you should be able to run the command speed test or speed test, uh, test dash CLI for command line uh, interface. But uh, it's the same command as far as I can tell. It's, it's the same package. It's just one is named different. I don't know if it's one's probably linked to another. Anyway, if you run that and you hit enter, it's actually going to start. Uh, you know, it's going to look at who your internet provider is, where you are, find the server nearby. Right now, mine is hitting Miami, which is on the other coast. Sometimes I run it and it grabs one in Benito, which is about 30 uh, minutes, 45 minutes away. So uh, I look through the um, the man pages. There might be a way to select your server because uh, Benita, like I said, is a half an hour drive from me, not, probably not even that, uh, where Miami is like a two hour drive. Uh, anyway, you can see my internet speeds to the download and upload, you know, that's pretty much about what I, I see when I test in my web browser. Now, uh, you're getting a lot of output here, you know, what it's connecting to, it gives you little dots as it's going. Uh, if you didn't want to see all that and you just want the output, uh, there's another option you can run. So you can do speed test or speed test uh, dash uh, command line dash dash simple. And when you run that, it just kind of runs without any input until it's done doing the test. And then it will give you your outputs, uh, your upload and download speeds. So we'll just let that run for a minute or 30 seconds, however long it takes. I guess it looks like, uh, you know, 28 seconds or that's, that's not some else. Okay. Let it go, let it go, let it go. There we go. Oh, so, so yeah, we got our ping time, which was that up there. It doesn't say ping time there, but that's what that was. Uh, and uh, then you got your download and upload. You know, my download wasn't as good at the time, but I don't know what server I was hitting. Because like I said, sometimes it's Bonita, sometimes it's Miami. Um, it might have hit something else. Uh, I think when I do online, sometimes it goes for a Tampa one, which is about two hours north of me. Um, so, you know, your speeds may vary, but you should get fairly consistent numbers somewhere around the ballpark. Uh, you know, you might say 10 megabits is a big difference because I know a lot of people who don't even get 10 megabits download uh, that live near me. Um, but uh, anyway, that's the speed test uh, command for your shell. And um, I mean... It's good to know this in case you're, you're logged into a server somewhere and you want to test your speeds uh, or you just like using the shell like I do. You don't have to open up a web browser and go to a web page and, and all that. This actually just does it from the shell. Uh, it can also be a good way to collect data. You could have this run every day at certain times of your day and log them all to a database or even a flat file and later on you can compare. It's like, oh, do I get the same speeds consistently? Uh, all the time or certain days, uh, uh, you know, time of day, do I get better speeds? So you could start collecting data on your own system this way. It's a lot easier than, you know, manually going into a web browser. So, um, yeah, check that out. Should be in your repositories again on uh, my Debian system here. So most Debian based systems, uh, I would assume it's, it's already in your package manager. Uh, and again, if you use apt, apt, apt get or aptitude install, and uh, it's probably going to be speed test dash CLI. If it's not, just search your repositories for speed tests, and it will probably be in there. Anyway, I uh, thank you for watching. I hope your speeds are fast enough to visit my website, filmsbychris.com. That's Chris the K. There's a link in the description. You can go there, check out all the videos from both my channels. Uh, you can also go to the support section or check out the links in the description of this video uh, for uh, support through patreon.com forward slash middle x1000 or through paypal uh, i do appreciate any support if you enjoy my videos be sure to search through all my videos i've got a lot of them some better than others and uh, as always i thank you for watching and i hope that you have a great day